Hi Aries, so I'm gonna do a bonus read for you and see what's coming up in your energies for Halloween. And I just wanna see what comes up for you Aries and get a clear message here for my Aries friends. Spirit, please show us what's coming up for Aries. What do they need to see or acknowledge? Please give us a clear message here for Aries. You're fighting for something and you're stressed. <laughs> Seven of Wands, Nine of Air. Hermit, okay. What are we, what is the root of this? The Fool, wanting to do something new, adventurous, letting go. New beginnings, oh wow, the Devil. Something was trying to take away your freedom. You're getting your freedom. It looks like you had to fight for it. You had to fight for... You felt left out in the cold. You felt shortchanged. Like something wasn't enough. There's a king of earth coming in. This could be your energy. There could be something you're getting that's more... Yeah, you're getting a Six of Pentacles. So you're getting the gift being given to you. Something here wasn't wasn't given. Oh, Two of Water. There's a couple around you. Um, a mutual soulmate. You want to be calm. You feel five of coin from the devil. Like you feel like somebody's not including you in something or not giving you something that you need on purpose. And what's the outcome? You don't want to quit. Nine of wands. You want to commit to this. But eight of cups, you don't like it. Eight of coin. Eight of cups. Like you feel like you want to put space or distance even though you're going to stay and Eight of Pentacles is like I'm going to be very specific. I'm going to work hard and commit to something. Okay, there's a water energy coming in. Messenger of water. An emotional person. Now, why are you nine of air? Why are you worried or concerned? Confusion, seven of cups, and a four of wands. Stability, a stable situation, but there's lots of choices or confusion. The judgment, something is being resurrected. And the queen of air, someone's making a decision, maybe being critical, being honest. Why is there a, why are you the six of coin? You're giving something of value. The queen of earth, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Hierophant, you're doing something the right way, correctly. Uh, what is the seven of wands here? Who's fighting back? Star card, okay. Rapid recovery, Aquarian energy. Um, something could somebody could be very pushy. Why do we have the judgment? The five of wands. There's a conflict or a competition, competitive energy. Four of earth. You're holding back your energy. You're not wanting to give or share. Seven of earth. Again, you're looking at the value. Three of cups. Sharing feelings with others. You could be looking at your money, saving your money. Messenger of fire, someone comes rushing in with passion. And then we have an empress, the goddess of abundance. What is the devil here? So we have a fire sign, an Aries, Leo, or Sag with new fire. Your energy is earth. So somebody may have had their heart broken here. The three of swords. They could feel isolated or alone. What is the two of cups around? 
the five of cups somebody is feeling sad or disappointed over a connection what is the moderate temperate okay you are somebody has to stay calm and keep something in perfect balance and rest heal why is there a king of pentacles here wow a ten of pentacles a long-term investment money wealth prosperity the hermit wisdom and high priestess both very spiritual energies <sighs> you're refusing to quit you feel like this isn't making you happy but you're like committed to it you're very driven and very persistent. Someone comes in and gives you a Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles comes in with an individual. Okay, well, so let's see how this is playing out for Aries energies. All right, Spirit, please show us here for Aries. The Ten of Swords, the ending of a painful situation, the Three of Wands, somebody's made up their mind, they're waiting for another ship to arrive, the Page of Water, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio, sending a message, Knight of Cups, no, I'm sorry, King of Cups, someone very emotional, taking action, Something here changes with the Wheel of Fortune. The Chariot, someone's coming towards you fast. Determined, they're not looking back. You could be helping them. Six of Pentacles is here. Four of Wands, stability is here. Providing stability, Eight of Wands, a lot of messaging coming in. Something's happening fast all at once. And the Queen of Swords, somebody's very bitter, maybe kind of angry, or just giving you some information, being logical. Two of Swords and Six of Swords. You're trying to make up your mind about something here so that you can have peace in your life. Hang hey, man. You feel stuck. Okay, show us here for Aries. Seven of Pentacles. You're looking at the value. Is something worth it? Is it growing? Is it increasing? What is the worth? Or... Um, are you reaping what you've been sowing? Looking at your karma. Page of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. Messenger. Six of Cups. And the Five of Cups. Feeling sad about the past. And the Magician. Gemini energy. Or somebody is trying to fix or solve the situation. What else for Aries? Seven of Wands again. Like you're pushing back. You're demanding from a Four of Swords. Somebody is not giving you the information. A Queen of the Pentacles. The Star card. There's a recovery. There's a rapid recovery. And a healing. Okay. Oh, goodness gracious. Let's see what we get for Aries. Show us for Aries here. Your wish is fulfilled. Path unknown. The treasure. A commitment. An Archangel Michael. 
So the wishes fulfilled did flip out. Now, whether it flipped out upside down or not, but it is the wishes fulfilled. Archangel Michael is the protector. Physical protection. Security. The commitment is like a contract. The, the hidden, the missing treasure and the path unknown. That could be like some journey you've been on already where you're missing something and you're waiting for it. And let's see, what else for Aries? The king of business, the king of keys. The Uriel and the Sphinx and the chess game. Somebody is playing some kind of like game. They're seeing like a, an opportunity as like a game, which is weird. However, they're using like spiritual energy. Uriel and the Sphinx is like very, very spiritual. Like the emerald tablets. It's kind of like a very spiritual energy. But the chess game is games. Like this is about making strategic moves. Something's been up in the air. The king of scrolls. A very w smart individual and somebody has unlimited inspiration with the waterfall. Set your course. The War of the Roses. Wow, there's something here that's like very competitive with you or around you. The Oracle of Delphi, Delphi, and the King of the Forces, and the King of the Roses. Someone could be showing you love, care, compassion, Archangel Gabriel, a messenger, diversity. The Akashic Records, the Community, the Architect, Archangel Gabriel, the Tower, the Lightning Bolt, Loving the Elementals, and a Commitment. Very important message about the development of something new. Something is in already written in your energetic history. King of Keys. And the Muse. The Balance. And Hilarion. Somebody is an advocate. Like they're advocating for you. Or you're advocating for them. The King of Roses and a King of Keys. So there could be something that is shocking or surprising. Um, there could be a, a karmic partner. Somebody could be someone that you have dealt with in a previous lifetime show us here for Aries indecision the world the happy family and walking away Seventh chakra connecting to Archangel Uriel and being patient. Many doors are opening. And 
and a broken heart. Wow. Hmm. Let's get one or two more to show us what's going on with Aries. What is going on with them on Halloween? It, basically, it's telling you to be patient. I mean, mod temperance has come out a hundred times. Be, stay calm. Don't let your emotions run away with you. You're getting information, the truth. You're going to get something new t about um, coming from an earth sign or about money. A page of the pentacles. Hierophant could be something about school, government, decisions made in court. King of Water is here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, somebody very emotional, compassionate but emotional. Oh, we have the devil. Okay. Somebody wants to be in full control of a situation. There's a lot of fire coming in. All at once, messaging, texts. It's happening all at once. Somebody is quite, quite um, annoyed, five of swords. Somebody feels like they're entitled for this. Somebody's angry, hostile. You're wanting to be Knight of Cups. You end up the Hermit. You spend time by yourself reflecting to figure this out or to turn within the death card. Somebody is a five of swords. Like they feel like this is the right thing to do. Um, hopefully it's not like revenge. Because you're wanting to apologize or you're wanting to express condolences. Five, two of swords. Balance is needed. There is karma or judgment. What is Page of Pentacles? Okay, there's a Nine of Swords consistently with this message. What is the death about? Fire in motion. Somebody moving ahead fast and fear. So something happens very rapidly. But the person is like... Um, they feel like it's somebody else's fault. A high Priestess, there was a secret. And there's a Queen of Water, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Why are you wanting to reach out? Okay, so you want to reach out or apologize. The Knight of Swords, somebody flew off the handle. But somebody did um, sneak off or sneak around behind people's backs. And the wheel turns. Things change. What is the death? The, so the death causes fear. Okay, somebody here is mad or upset. Seven of Rods. Standing their ground, demanding, wanting to know. Turning within, there is the death, there is the change. Somebody rushes in with an urgent message, fire in motion, rushing, eight of swords. Someone is feeling like they're trapped, isolated, alone, the wheel turns, seven of swords. Somebody's sneaky, um being a sneaky trickster and then we have someone here defending themselves five of pentacles feeling left out in the cold or like something was taken from you be careful on a halloween to me i never used to celebrate halloween but because i always saw it as a day of mischief so just be careful on halloween some people are out to do bad things like to to cause crazy havoc 
There's an Ace of Pentacles coming. What's this Ace of Pentacles? Hangman, something that was stuck or something that was on pause. It requires great strength and there is something that is disappointing or sad. Queen of Swords, somebody gives you the news or the information. Chariot card moving forward fast, determined. Four of Cups, somebody is not interested in the Fool. Somebody is living in the moment, doing what they want to do, and someone's Four of Cups. Like passing, like I don't care, I don't want that. And then we have here an Eight of Cups, somebody's walking away, putting space or distance. Somebody's very curious, wanting to know, asking questions. Maybe being a gossip, backstabbing someone. Somebody's been very loyal to someone, helping them, giving them things. Well, Aries, that's your bonus reading. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.